Today we're back in Fernville Lane District 28 where we have a ground floor 3 bed patio unit that's fully renovated coming onto the market for 1.45 mil. Everyone, this is the Topiary. Okay, so we're on level 13 which is the Sky Garden and this space has all the facilities like the rain shower, you've got the jacuzzis going, you've got a massage bed over there, sauna room inside and it's divided into male and female and luckily for you, the unit has direct access from its block doorstep coming all the way up so this is quite specific to only this stack. So let's go now to the project stats and I'll tell you more. So designed by DP Architects, this land size is 22,000 square meters, GFA 77,000 square meters and a TOP in 2016 with a tenure of 99 from 2012 with a total number of 700 units across 8 blocks going as high as 23 stories. Okay, let's go to the map. Topiri is part of the northeast region and it sits in District 28 Sengkang Planning Area right in the heart of Fernvale and you'll find that the project is near to several childcare centers and primary schools just across the road. Welcome to the unit guys. So now let's go to the floor plan and I want to tell you a little bit more about the configuration. At 1,334 square feet, this unit comes with 3 bedrooms and 2 baths. Through the front door, there's a dining and then that leads us into the living. Then down the corridor, we have 3 bedrooms, 2 bathrooms with the kitchen on the right which leads you to a yard and WC to the back. Then you've got a beautiful spacious balcony that runs all the way through. So let's start off here in the patio because this is really one of the rare USPs for this unit. Nowadays, because of regulations, you're not going to get full length patios like this on the market anymore. And it's quite rare for you to have this kind of long planter that goes along this side and it's been kept quite nicely. You have the southeast facing, facing out so no west sun, that's very nice and temperate. You've got water features going outside and then you can see that our owners have placed in bicycles over here so you can really utilize this as an outdoor space for your kids to have fun, to tumble and rumble or place in you know, a dining table where you can have some fresco dining. Now let's go inside. So there's a lovely wide entrance over here with full panel sliding doors that let you in from the side access and then of course there's a main door over there that I'll show you in a bit. Now let me talk you through this living room. So we've really staged up the place and it's very nice going with the artwork and a cozy couch over here because the owners have spent more than 100000 to really do up the place. So talk about mood and vibe, the renovations are perfect. You've got a TV console fully done up with storage over here to store away all your barang barang and it'll be nice and neat just tucked away like this and then there's a continuation of the team and this is something like a very rustic limestone kind of thing going here and they've really set up a very nice leather kind of bound couch over here for you to you know just kick back relax and uh, have a nice KTV night if you like then we're going into the walkway over here and just notice the carpentry it curves along this side and all these our storage spaces for you to just put away your shoes for him and her and you've got more than enough this is actually the main door let me just show you because this is a patio unit right we're going outside and this is the lift lobby that takes you uh, directly out to the visitor parking car parks and then if we flip it around I'll show you that this is your access back out into the facilities so now let's head back inside I want to show you the kitchen Okay, now let's head into the walkway over here and immediately to the right, you'll see a transition in team because you'll start to see these walnut door frames that lead you into the kitchen. So it's a very nice, good sized space where you have two sides of countertops, carpentry, overhead and below and it's quite rare to get nowadays this four burner gas open flame hood and oven going and then you even have a backyard over here with a Steigen system, check this out. So if you're wondering about drying your clothes, then you have this indoor drying function. Okay, now let's head into the common bedroom which is just right across this hallway. So you'll find that this is a very good sized bedroom and you have laminate uh, timber look-alike tiles and this is a cool shade that's running across. Then uh, you'll find that you have open glass panel sliding windows that can really open up here. So because this is a patio unit, if you're wondering about privacy, you've got curtains here for shade. Um, the building wardrobes are done up nicely for you, complete with the AC. Let's go to the next room just by the side where they've set up as a study room. 
So check it out. There is a long counter that curves ergonomically like this down against a platform bed that they've done up. So this is like a home office come a uh, kid's room over here because their kids are very young right now the kids basically live with them but this can be used totally as a guest room plus a study if you didn't want this then uh, you can obviously demolish this table turn it into you know a full-size bedroom right across there is a common bathroom where you have grey non-slip tiles which is consistent across wide mirror and you got the venetian blinds for your privacy now let's head into the master which is just to the left of the walkway and as soon as you come through you'll find that you have all this carpentry space already done up for you the ID is put in you have a very lovely curved false ceiling that runs through the wall that makes it very beautiful then you have a huge king size bed setting over here with storage and all this is built in with this cushion backboard and the mirrors and then the dresser for the missus then they specifically set in a space for the TV which is quite beautiful then you have access to the patio as well and check out the master bathroom. So if you've been enjoying this home tour so far, then kindly smash that like button and please subscribe to our channel. Subscription will be very low there. Help a brother out. Let's now go into the living room. I want to talk to you about the numbers. Okay, so we did a comparison of one kilometer radius close by projects that are comparable. And this is what we found. Topiri ranks second most affordable amongst the five other neighbours with High Park residents taking the lead at an average of 1,241 PSF. So with our unit asking of just 1,086 PSF, it's well within a comfortable range as you can see, the price tags closer to the project's average. And this is much lower than High Park residents and Salita residents. Okay, now let's talk about the cash flow. Assuming your entry is 1.45 mil and a 75% loan to value, 1.5% interest rate across 25 years tenure, then your monthly installment value is $4,349. So let's put in the husband and wife CPF contribution of 1260 times 2, and you'll fall into a cash value of 1,829. This is the cash component that you need to pay. So let's assume that somewhere down the line, you want to rent out the place. And let's run through the rentals and your monthly rental aggregated to an average is 2,800. So less away this value, you'll be left with a $971 positive cash flow. Then let's also factor in your maintenance fee of $350 and your property tax of $41 and you'll be still left with a positive cash sum that goes into your bank every single month. How cool is that? Okay, let's go into the location and before that, let's talk about the business development in the northeast area. So you have multiple wafer fabrication plants that are coming up in the Sengkang West Industrial Park and this is going to give rise to more potential high-skilled laborers that are going to come in. So that means that your tenant pool is going to grow. So let's talk about your convenience and the amenities. So there are six supermarkets within a one kilometer radius and the closest one is Cold Storage Greenwich and Fairprice Jalan Kayu. So of course you also have Greenwich V and Seletar Mall nearby. Then within a one kilometer radius you have three schools namely Fernville Primary, Sengkang Green and Peihua Secondary. If you're wondering about buses then you've got 10 bus stops within a one kilometer radius and these are the bus services. So if this feels like your next home, then smash that like button and give us a call. I'm Nick Tan, Setting Singapore, and we'll be happy to show you the place. I'll see you soon.